Hello and welcome back to Top10List.org where you get a world of knowledge and 10 simple points. Today's episode is going to be about Top 10 Assistive Technologies. And we're going to go ahead and start at number 10 with step-by-step communicators. Students with disabilities often have trouble interacting around sound or social situations. They get lost in words trying to say what's on their mind, and this program allows them to record 75 messages they can use as a means for communication. Number nine is PDA or mobile learning. Personal digital assistants, PDAs or tablets, are used for digital note-taking purposes. It also features an organizer, which helps students manage and organize their time effectively. Textbooks are now offered on many PDAs to eliminate the need to carry heavy textbooks. Number eight is Inspiration. The program is similar to Kidspiration, but is appropriate for students in intermediate and senior levels in education. Both programs can be used by adolescents, but Inspiration will be more useful. Number seven is Kidspiration. The program helps young students with learning disabilities and language learning issues. It helps them organize their thoughts, materials, and ideas. The pictures, text, numbers, and spoken words are used to advance students' vocabulary, word recognition, comprehension, reasoning, and problem-solving skills. Number six is Speak Q. This program is complete with speech recognition. Students who are physically disabled or slow at writing can use this program to dictate what they wish to write. Overall, it is an excellent assistive technology, however, the computer takes time to get used to the voice speaking to it. The computer may unintentionally make a few errors just at first. Number five is WatchMinder. This device is a rich watch used by students with learning disabilities. It helps them organize and manage their time, and it also makes sure that students are on top of things and not slowing behind. For those who are hard of hearing, the device has a vibrator. And number four is Kurzweil. This program provides reading and writing materials which help people, mainly students, with vision problems and learning disabilities such as dyslexia. There are many scanned and copied material and books on Kurzweil. And number three is a talk pad. This is a picture schedule for students with disabilities such as ASD. Some students with ASD have trouble following a schedule that is different than their normal routines. Teachers have to use repetitive verbal prompts to keep the students on track. The TalkPad is a device which pre-records three steps for those students that have time management and organizational issues. Picture schedules are there to complement the verbal cues. Number two is Word Cue. This program recommends words students can use when writing. It also offers spoken vocabulary to help students find mistakes. The program is used by children of all ages and has a set of vocabulary for all levels. Overall, it is an excellent text-to-speech program that benefits students with special needs. And last but not least on the list is the Bionic Ear. The Bionic Ear is an assistive technology that is useful for all students with hearing impairment. The teacher wears a microphone cuffed to his or her shirt, and the student wears a listening device which is attached to their ear. Teachers will never have to scream to get their point across, and usually all students will be able to understand with this technology. To date, tests have been done on cadavers, while so researchers know that the device works, the sound signals are being transmitted to the right parts of the ear, and vibrating the umbo. That doesn't tell anyone what the experience might be like for students wearing the device. Tests in living patients are still a few years away. Overall, the bionic ear has proven its effectiveness in the classroom for students with hearing impairment. Well, that concludes our list for top 10 assistive technologies. If you enjoyed, click subscribe and don't hesitate to join us again for another episode of Top 10 List.